Hey, what's going on guys? I'm here with a video showing my process of making thumbnails. And I just I just recorded this whole thing and Bandy Cam, you see the thing at the top there. If you haven't I had it on my second monitor and I thought it was still gonna record this monitor. Of course it didn't, it showed my second monitor. So I have to re record this, do everything I did already. So <laughs> what I usually do is I go to Google Images and find the title. Surgeon Simulator 2013 title. And then just images. There, like that. I already have, I already did this already. But that is what I did before. So I saved it. I already did it all. And then I will open it. Right there. And what I do is just magic racer. There. Easy. But I usually go through and perfect it. So I just go around and get rid of the black spots. And then see if I mess up, I'll just do control Z. And if I mess up like that, control Z, you know. Easy. And I know it's pr probably seems unnecessary, but I go in every little detail and do this, like, I perfect it. Like, get rid of that. Like, you might think that is unnecessary. And these ones, like, you, I don't even think you noticed those before. But I, I like to perfect it, because I want it to make it as, look as good as I can. So I go through and get every little thing I think that could make it look better. So, yeah. It might probably seems unnecessary to you, but not to me. I like to make it look as good as I can. So, yeah, I just do this. I don't know what to say, really. I just do this. It's, it's easy. And... Yeah, so let's say I'm, I'm done there. I'll zoom out. And there we go. And then I will make new. I have a preset for thumbnails. I'll go here, drag it to the thumbnail. And then resize it so it's about the size of the thumbnail. So I'd put it in like the top corner or something. And then blending options. Um, stroke, sometimes I'd use that and put it to 1 or something, but in this case it doesn't look that good. I'll do drop shadow, I always use drop shadow. So, I put it to 90, opacity, opacity, whatever you want to pronounce it, and then it looks like that. Sometimes 9, I don't know. And, see the shadow under it? And then gradient overlay, no. I never use, I don't use that. I use that for text, but that's it. And sometimes I might... Actually, why does it... It looks different, actually. Why? That's why. Okay, let me... Um, undo that. Delete. There. So let's drag it to the right thing this time. And then put it in the corner. I noticed the shadow. It wasn't going the right direction. So now you'll see what I mean. And drop shadow. Now it's going the right way. 90. And then I usually set it to 8 or 9. 8. It's good. <coughs> and not stroke this time. Not bevel and emboss. That's... Uh, sometimes that looks good, but not in this case. Um, again, gradient overlay is stupid. I would never use that for those. <laughs> it's stupid. You can... You can make it sort of like faded, but it's pointless. And outer glow. Sometimes I use that. And I'll show you what I mean in a second. You'll see it. And I usually set it to maybe 90 there too. 50 size. 50 size I said. Thank you. And then... And then let me just make it so you can actually see it. And then see this, the glow. That helps a lot with some things. And I'll just turn it off. I don't need it for that. It's not good on that one. Let me get rid of that. And the next step would usually be getting a screenshot for it, but since I haven't even recorded this yet, I will... I didn't even, didn't even get it. Okay, well, you'll see the process of getting the thing then. Well, usually I just get a screenshot of the video, but... I don't have it. I don't have a video of it yet. I'm just making a thumbnail ahead of time just to do this, and then I would maybe get a picture, save image as, save, close that. Yes, and then 
Drag it there. Let's resize it so you don't see the HUD or anything. Do that. Then I use, there's no I tried to find a font for this and there isn't. So if there's no font, I, I would usually what I would do if I want to get a font, like if the, see if there is a font for the game in particular. So I would do Surgeon Simulator 2013. Okay, why did it not do that? Surgeon Sim 2013 font and see the font is the, um, probably the best site because it's all free fonts what's this font blah 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 I'd like to know too no so no one knows and I couldn't find a font when I recorded this before so if there's no font for the game in that case I would probably use the best looking font that I have which I have tons and tons of fonts <clears throat> so what I used before when I failed the recording. I used the Batman Forever font. I did number one. I put it right there. And then I'll do blending options. Stroke. I'll, usually three is okay. Drop shadow again. It's always good to do that. Then eight. Eight's usually the perfect number. Gradient overlay. And I'll change it red. Like dark red. And then that. And then change that sort of like brighter so it looks good or that no that's bad that's not good that's good that's decent and then then I for numbers I usually do the outer glow and I'll set it to 90 actually 90 is not that good I'll do 75 like it was at set it to white and then that to 50 Actually, let me do the lower the number. Actually, the more like dense it looks, but the less it's out. So let's say 90. It's out farther, but it's more faded. So I'll do maybe 30. Not enough. So 45. But then I can make the opacity higher, so it looks darker. Spread maybe two. I know five. That's better. And then, then maybe I could do 55. And then, then it looks good. You probably don't see any differences between what I just did, but I do. So, that's... I am done already. That's it. That's literally it. It's that quick. So, you see, it looks like a perfect thumbnail. But sometimes, actually, for the text, I notice if sometimes no stroke, which is the outline, looks better. In this case, it doesn't, but usually, like, it would either be better if it's smaller, so maybe two, or one. Actually, one's good. That's better. There. That's that's it. That's all I do for thumbnails. I've done this a million times, so it just goes by like nothing for me. It's simple for me. I've done this a million times now, because you know my thumbnails. I make different things for every thumbnail, so... It's simple for me now. It's like goes by me like a robot now. So that, that's the process of making thumbnails for all my videos. That's literally every video. And I'll show you, like, I'll open Outlast. This case, Outlast has a font, so I could do, like, poo, poop. And it's in the Outlast font. So, James. Yeah, it, it helps when a game has a font, like someone made a font for the game. Because then I can do this, and it makes it easy. So... The number actually isn't the last font, but it's probably a good looking like horror font. I just searched like horror font or something, or you know, you saw like, Google. I did Surgeon Simulator font, and there wasn't, so I didn't use it, obviously. So that is my process of making thumbnails. If you enjoyed it, comment, like, subscribe. It's much appreciated, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.